Hello, hello. What's up, everybody? Welcome in. Welcome back to Sam Loves Gaming. Again, we are playing Alone in the Dark today. This is part four, if I don't keep restarting the game. <laughs> but welcome in, everybody. I hope you guys had a good weekend. Thanks for being here. Happy Monday. Today's April 15th. We are live. Um, it is 11.31 a.m. We are live in the United States. That is mountain time for you guys. Welcome in. Hey, Ghost. Hey, Shally. Welcome in. Hey, Monet. You're awesome. Thanks for being here. Monet, you are always first coming in lately. Appreciate the support. AJ, thank you so much. Thanks for being here. What's up, Julio? Welcome in. Mountain time, best time, <laughs> says Shally. Oh, man. I missed everybody. Hope you guys had a good weekend. Um, it was my daughter's birthday over the weekend, so I didn't want to stream um, over the weekend and stuff. I was just hanging out with my kiddos. So, yeah, April's a busy month for us. A lot of birthdays in my family. <laughs> All right, let's get back to this. I wonder if I should load in where I saved. I also have an auto save. Guess we'll continue. Hopefully, this is a good spot. <laughs> Yay! Okay, we were talking to this little baddie right here. Thank you. I appreciate that. Ghost from the chat said, Happy birthday to your daughter, Sam. Thank you. Okay, so I already spoke to her. Let's peep these objectives. Oh, they seem like a handful. The talk about Jeremy and the dark man made it sound like she might know something of importance. But ultimately, it felt like a dead end. Julio said, that's so cool. Thank you. Yeah, I hope you guys all had a good weekend. Thanks for being here today. Let's see. I got um I got some tools. So I think we could loo and check some other rooms. I'm super happy for that. Let's see what's going on in here. Nothing. A box full of nothing. Always getting my hopes up. <gasps> Woo! Looks like we need some sort of needle. Great Depression um set. That one's almost complete. I have lost children. <laughs> uh, that that set still creeps me out, but that's okay. I'll live with it. Oh, I could go in here. What? Oh, okay, that makes sense. Can I go back in that room or no? Okay, yes. I just never know, guys. I always have to double check. Um, Julio says, oh, Sam, you could call me Julio. Okay. Thanks for being here today. Appreciate that. I'm just sipping a little coffee. Coffee and ice water. I know it's a weird combo. <laughs> oh man, okay. Oh, I can't go through that door. Okay, I already went through these rooms. Let me go back in here and see if I could go through the door that I came in. I got a lot of objectives <laughs> finished. I was kind of stuck for a minute, but we're, we're starting to flow now. Okay, now I gotta fix the bloody broiler. Yo, Bloodshot, welcome in. How you doing today? Okay. 
So I was able to come in through here. Okay. Oh wow, all those doors led to right there. Okay. Yeah, I'm a detective. It's like a mystery. Yes, it is. A lot of puzzles. But I got some stuff, so let's go into some rooms I couldn't enter before. Because now I got this little knife where I think I could use it to pry open some doors. Oh, okay, that's the door I pried open. Oh, I still can't enter that room. Bloodshot from the chat said, I'm good, I'm on with Bullet, gotta get my honeydews done. I got your live going on TV. Hey, I appreciate that, thanks so much. I hope you and Bullet are having a good time. I'll definitely be on some CTAs. Double CTA. Yeah. I miss me some CTAs. But for now, I gotta... Gotta see what's up. Oh, I got a cellar key. Okay, let's go downstairs to the wine cellar. Now I could fix this. Just have to check these rooms, you know? Never know if there's something else that may appear. Oh, I still can't open this door. Okay, that's, that's good to know. I still can't go in the kitchen. <laughs> she locked me out of the kitchen, huh? finally made it in here I wonder if Emily is wait I'm the detective and I'm helping a young lady by the name of Emily find her uncle Jeremy here and this mansion be tripping I don't know if there's like the mansion be switching up if some rooms are like shape-shifting, taking me to different dimensions. I don't know what's going on yet, guys. Or if I looked at this crazy-ass painting and now I'm going crazy. <laughs> nice. Okay, finally. We're getting somewhere. There we go. <clears throat> oh, I had to turn the power off. Okay. Should have did some looting though before I turned it off. Oh, it won't even let me turn it back on. Dang, okay. Okay. <gasps> the valve! Yes! We found the valve, guys. <clears throat> I knew I stopped last week at a good spot, you know? <laughs> we were fighting those freaks in that swampy dimension. I don't know what was going on. It was scary. See, we have to, there's some sort of freaks that come out, and then there's the puzzle we have to do, so that's my type of game. Let's get it. Okay. Wait. Is there anything else over here? Just gotta double check. It's really dark. Sorry if this part's so dark, guys. I did mess with the contrast and the lighting to get it as bright as possible. Turn that contrast down a little bit. So I, hopefully that helps the viewers at home. Okay. Oh my gosh, what the hell? Oh my goodness. Oh my gosh! I only had one hit! Oh my gosh, that was hella scary. Okay, drink your booze. Every video game always needs booze for your life, right? Okay, that was hella scary. Is there any other freaks over here? I just cut the power. I didn't think the freaks would come in. 
Julio said, cool, I'm sure you'll figure you'll figure it out in the game. Yeah. Just takes a little time to get there. I'm, I'm always scared I'm going to miss something. Okay, I have the valve. There we go. Yes, let's get it. Great. I'm still missing a piece here for the broiler plate. I'm missing two pieces. I wonder if I still need to find those. Let's peep the objectives. Yep, repair the decorative plate on the broiler. Okay, we still have to do that. Whoops. Jeremy? Is that Jeremy? Before I talk to Jeremy, is there anything to loot? Is that Uncle Jeremy? <gasps> what the hell is going on? What the family? Where's the body? Is that a plate? All right, we got a plate. That was freaky. <laughs> Let me know if you guys think that was freaky. Kong didn't know what to make of the grotesque vision of the dead club. Was he dead? Or was it all fiction? Mm. Let me sip my coffee. Let's go on to this. This next part. That was trippy, yo. That was super trippy. Okay, am I still missing one plate, though? Oh, we're missing one more plate. Okay, one more plate. Now we have to go look for the last plate. Wait, I think when we complete these sets, um, they unlock something for us. I don't know what I got, but I think I got something. I don't know if I got the knife or something. Well, I took it from that bag, so I think this set helped me get the shotgun unlocked. So I have a shotgun now. Do I still have the shoddy? Okay, yep, I still have the shoddy. Put the shoddy away, Sam. Sorry, I'm still new to this game. I have a hard time putting my weapons away. I don't know how to holster my weapons. But we definitely need to find um, that last plate. Can I go in here now? You know, one of the ladies kicked me out of the kitchen. She 86'd me. find the other plate. Did I explore some new spots? Now let's peep the map. Oh, there's a puzzle in the drawing room. Okay. The clerk's office. There's also a puzzle. Is that the uh, safe? So do I get to open the safe? Dang, this guy's really a dirty detective. <laughs> Julio said, you got this, Sammy. Thank you. All right. Let's see. See, that's the bag I got the knife from. I got the shotgun there. There's nothing else in here. Is this the one of the puzzles? This room's scary. <laughs> the music will play off and on.
bad I didn't have my varmint to take out those crows. <laughs> All right, I think was that little room the puzzle? Oh, whoops! Can't use my mouse while on a ladder. The drawing room, okay. Lottie's room, that's upstairs. Okay, that's next to Lottie's room, okay. I need the key. Oh, I still, oh, still can't enter that room. There's no way I can get into this thing. Better leave it alone. Okay, I need to find a combination for this safe. But there's something in that room. I don't know if that was the drawing room. I don't know if I have to look at the stars <clears throat> and get a code from there. But I, I have a key. What is this key to the sitting room? Or the, where the heck's the sitting room? There's the sitting room, okay. There's something missing. Oh, there's a piece missing on there, okay. Interesting, interesting. Oh snap, this doll this is creepy. This must be that kid's room. Why does she seem so familiar? Don't you worry, Grace. Go play your game, bleat and bellow with the others. I won't be jealous. There will be more masquerades. However, I would love it if you would finish my mask for the feast. With love, Ruth. Oh my goodness, these babies are big and scary. Okay, nothing else? Alright. from somewhere. I remember you, Mr. Conby. From where? Don't touch that. Cassandra wouldn't like it. She wouldn't like it at all. Do you know where she is? I'd rather not talk about it. It makes me upset. Besides, she'll be back after the Feast of St. John. You think? Yep. It's all on the page, Mr. Conby. And many of them that sleep in the dust of the earth shall awake, some to everlasting life, and some to shame and everlasting contempt. All right. 
I'm gonna go now, if that's okay. I don't like to stay too long in the same place. Mr. McCoffee might find me. Hey. Is he mean to you? Not everyone needs to be saved, Mr. Conby. You should know that by now. Okay. So this is where Cassandra Beauregard ended up. For some reason, I thought she died years ago. Miss Beauregard, I picked up your medicine at the post office today. As you understand, it needs to be administered by the orderlies for your safety. I have put the box in Lottie's room for now, and I'm sure she will find you as soon as possible. Mr. Waits. Welcome in, welcome in. Thank you, Alzoido. Welcome in, Suje. Thank you, thank you for the visit. It's another one of those strange padlocks. Oh, great. Another one with zodiac signs. Great. Don't tell. Oh, and the last piece is in there. Another zodiac one. You guys know I struggled with the last one. Okay, we'll do it again. Oh my. There's more of that rod again. Like it's guiding me to do something. Oh, oh shoot. If I find the full set of bottles, then maybe I can make something out of the stains of rot. I don't think I have everything I need. Okay. Now we need a bottle. Now the code is going to be on the bottle. Great. Okay. Now we got to find another bottle, guys. Is there anything else in here? Let me look at the bottles one more time. I don't think I have everything I need. Okay, so now we know where the last piece of the boiler is. We got to get this little combination to the Zodiac. So let me the see, where's my little diary? The medicine bottles had stains of rot on the labels, suggesting some greater shape. They just needed to be put in the right order. But for what purpose? Dang, that door did me dirty. It didn't even want to let me out. Okay. Oh my goodness, that does not look good. Uh, well, this bathroom's a lot more decent than the last one. <laughs> Welcome in, everybody. Thanks for the visit. Okay, let's go do some searching now. Looks like some kind of rot. Well, at least I only need to get one bottle, right? To solve the little puzzle. Okay. Bounce to the next room. Gosh, I get lost. Even though I have a map and I've been into some of these rooms many times, I still get lost in this mansion.
I wonder if I have to come back to this map. Colony. I remember hearing about their disappearance. Must have been 15 years or more now. Good evening. Good evening, lady. You see any rotting bottles over here? Oh, she drank all that whiskey from the last time I spoke to her. Dang. She's a whiskey girl. Okay. Closely. Gotta find the bottle. <laughs> All these doors. Oh my goodness. They're making myself dizzy. Okay, I need the rotting bottle. Look at that bloody Sam Hal. Am I going to get a rotting bottle medicine? Okay, I have to match that bottle for my next little clue. The next little puzzle. If I find out the man we're looking for, which is Uncle Jeremy, if I find out he's playing games at the end with his voodoo stuff, I am gonna flip a lid. Just kidding. <laughs> I'm really curious to see what's gonna happen. Ooh, chapter 2's been a long chapter. A lot of crazy stuff's happened. Okay. I don't see any bottles. I'd hang out in this room any day. It seems peaceful, but um, this tree, I hear this tree whispering, so it's pretty scary. Can the tree tell me where the bottle is? <laughs> okay, I definitely can't go out that little window.
<laughs> What's up and welcome in trees that whispering. <laughs> I know those trees are crazy. Pretty scary. Wish they would tell me something though. Okay, no bottle down here. everything I need. Miss Beauregard, I picked up your medicine at the post office today. As you understand, it needs to be administered by the orderlies for your safety. I have put the box in Lottie's room for now, and I'm sure she will find you as soon as possible. <clears throat> Mr. Waits. <clears throat> Excuse me. What the heck? So... Right now, I have to go to um, Lottie's room. I don't even know where to get a key for that lockbox, but I think we have to get in the lockbox to get the medicine bottle. <clears throat> okay, now, what the bloody Sam, how am I going to do here? Okay. I don't think I have everything I need. There's nothing else I could get in here, yo. Okay. I have to, um, I have to get a key. I don't know where to get a key. I'm gonna have to get a key to get up in there. Okay, let's see. Grace and Cassandra's room. Go back into Grace's room? Okay, let's see. What is in Grace's room? I'm gonna follow the map because they give me little hints. So see how it'll say a puzzle right there? Oh, let's see though. Head back in there. What could be in Grace's room?
Oh, I could take that. Oh, wow. I didn't know that was a collectible. I thought it was just a toy. Okay. Okay, one more for that collection. I think I could unlock something when I collect these two. I think these help me progress in the game when I complete these sets. Okay, wow. Okay, that makes a lot of sense. I probably need one more. Okay, I'm done with the puzzle in Grace's room. Okay, the sitting room. Is that where I could find the key? I need to get into Lottie's uh, lockbox. Lottie was one of the orderlies or like one of the nurses. So I have to um, get in her lockbox for that medicine bottle. That's what I'm assuming. The heck else can be in Cassandra's room? Nope, I'm going to have to come back to her room. There's no other clues in here for me. I don't think I have everything I need. Welcome in, everybody. Thanks for watching. Thanks for the visit. Can't believe I missed that collectible. I gotta be careful now. Who knows what other collectibles I missed. Okay, had me come back to this. So there's a puzzle I need to do here. The telescope, but I don't know what I need. That music is hella scary though, I'm not gonna lie.
The Barlow Lens Instructions To double the magnification of your telescope, simply fit this Barlow lens to your instrument. Then operate the fine tuners to adjust the distance between your lenses. This is easily done while looking through your eyepiece. Simply search for a position where your picture is clear and appears flat. When correctly tuned, your telescope should present a clear picture with magnificent magnification. There's no way I can get into this thing. Don't you worry, Grace. Go play your game, bleat and bellow with the others. I won't be jealous. There will be more masquerades. However, I would love it if you would finish my mask for the feast. With love, Ruth. Miss Beauregard, I picked... Sunday, June 22nd. I spent all day looking for Jeremy. I should have cared for the others, but I'm scared that he will do something irreversible. Cassandra is upset that I didn't give her the latest shipment of pain medication that Waits brought from the post office yesterday. I would have given it to her, but the company didn't send a new key this time around, so the box is just sitting there on my desk. They must have figured we had plenty of their gimmicky keys by now. I only remember seeing one lately. Grace was playing with it inside the grand parlor. Unless it turns up by itself, it will have to wait. I have to figure out where Jeremy is. I think Jack knew something. That dog of his found a strange rot permeating the house. She's showing us, he said. Like those blots and streaks of fetid rot was talking to him.
All right, sorry about that, everybody. I had to use the restroom. Better leave it alone. Okay, I need to get... I, I have to do a puzzle to do another puzzle to unlock something. <laughs> I need the key. Right now, I need to get in Lottie's medicine box for that bottle. Okay, so... Let me look around and see if I'm missing any other clues. Let's get my mini-map. Great, when I think it's a clue, it's just more booze. When I think it's a clue, it's just more booze. What the heck did we just walk into? I'm scared, guys. I hope this room doesn't change and like warp us to some freakish dimension. <laughs> My goodness. Oh my goodness, it's scary up here. Ooh, that would be a fall I would not want to take. Oh my gosh. Did you guys hear that? I can't go in that room, but it sounded pretty scary. Ooh, that'd be a nasty little fall. Mm. Oh my gosh, I don't have a key? Can I just jump down there? 
where the heck is this? Is, is this a new part of the map? <clears throat> oh, that's how you get there. Okay, so I had to enter from this the shenanigans. Okay, that makes sense. Okay, medicine box key. Nice. What else is in here? I need some more ammo and some more booze. <laughs> and we need more keys. We could never have enough keys in this game. Ooh, what's in here? Please be more keys. Oh, ammo. Ammo, you can never go wrong. With the freaks that be coming out in this game. It's the syringe. Okay, so I think we got another full set. Yes! Okay, I need one, two more pieces before I can have two more sets. Actually, three. Okay, nice. That is awesome. That's a pretty jacked up set. <laughs> if you look at it that way. Okay. Oh, I still can't open that door? What the heck? I get scared opening doors in here. I don't know if I'm going to go to another dimension or what's going to happen. Ooh. Ugh. There's more of that aggressive rot. Damn. On the common place of evil. There lies virtue and stark irreverence, careless thoughts of luminous indifference. But blame not the beast we once were, which science so often wished to refer. Not the wicked full of sin, it is you who stand and grin. All our good intentions aside, whereupon we build our pride. Sunless solitude, follow not this corrupting light. Prophets of confidence always crashes out of sight. Hear me, for we all bear this mark. Thus we must remain alone in the dark. That was pretty creepy. That was a little creepy one. I'm creeped out with this right here. Hey, Angie, what's up? Welcome in, hun. Welcome in. How are you doing today, Angie? Jose, welcome in. How you doing, Jose? Welcome, and thanks for the visit today. Okay, we're finally getting somewhere. Dang, it's complicated to get around in this mansion. It's not as easy as it looks. Oh, wow, I... I went all the way in a circle. I hope I'm not missing anything else in that other room. Jose, um, from the chat said, I'm doing great. How about you? I'm doing good. Thanks for asking. Doing really good. Thank you so much. Oh, so I came out of that door and opened it. Okay. Weird. Odd. But I didn't. I feel like I should go back in here. I hope I'm not missing anything. I hope everybody had a nice weekend and thanks for the visit today. Oh, I did miss something. More life. I need the key. Oh, I need a key to go down there. What is down there? I really wonder. Oh, 
Oh, that lady is gone. Oh, nice. Okay. She left. She drank her whiskey and she left me a little, a little collector. Okay, nice. Really gotta make sure you scavenge things good. Alright, now I have to go back to Cassandra's room. Hopefully it don't take me forever to do this puzzle. Hopefully I can figure this one out good. <laughs> okay. Oh, I barely made the door. <laughs> These doors will slam right on your face. Okay, let's put the bottle back. Okay, let me pay attention here now. So we have to switch these bottles. Hey Gen X Gaming, what's up and welcome. Thanks for the visit. Oh snap, okay, I could rotate them like this. Alright. Hey, what's up, Brave Kratos? Welcome in. How are you doing today? of a snake. There must be something important to find here. Maybe it has something to do with the numbers on the labels. The numbers on the labels? Two, five. I don't know what the other number says. Okay, I can't rotate them anymore. So we have, so far we have two, five, seven, but what does the middle bottle say? Does it say one? Is that a one AC? I mean the second, um, the second before you're right. So two, five, one, seven. Is that what I think it is? One, seven. I'm going to put it in the chat, guys, so I don't forget. I'm thinking that's what it may be. Two, five, one, seven, yeah. Is that a one right there? The second to the right? I can't even see it because the rot is like right over the number of the bottle. Okay, that's weird. Two five seven one. Wait, wait, no, the other one isn't a number then, yeah? 
Is it just 257? Okay, so shall we do just do 257? Let's see what the zodiac is for that. Um, Pisces is 2. Gemini is 5. So let's do Pisces and Gemini. Okay, and then the last one, so Pisces, Gemini, what is seven, Leo? Hopefully this works, guys. Yes, finally. Okay. Broken plate. Okay, nice. We got it. Yes. I thought, guys, to be honest, I was going to have to go back to, um... Was it Grace's room? Whose room was that? Let me see. It's my patient list. I think it was um, Isabella's room. I thought I was going to have to go back in there. Was it Grace? Or Yeah, I thought it was Isabella's room. Thank God I have her journal. So I don't have to go back in there. I finally got them for once. Because it was 257, there was no one. <laughs> Alright, let's go put this boiler plate in. Let's get this dang thing going it's on the last plate. <clears throat> Yo, what up, Hot McFly? It has been a minute. Thanks for the visit, and I hope all has been well with you. I am a detective playing a crazy game right now. But so far, I am enjoying myself. Okay, let's take the plate. Jeez, that was a lot of things to do for chapter two. <laughs> Hot McFly said, yeah, I'm doing all right, LOL. Oh, that's good to hear. Thanks for the visit. It's good to see you in the chat again. I really appreciate it. Mm, I need the key. Alright, hopefully no freaks come out now. Thank you! drink some water now there is this puzzle to do great okay just great where do where do we start sammy girl Okay, this looks like some sort of little church or something. Let's see if I could get these pictures matched up. Greddy, what's up and what's going on? Welcome. Thanks for the visit. Hot McFly, you could do puzzle now in Red Dead. <laughs> what are you talking about, Hot McFly? Please tell me.
Oh, great. This, this one's going to take me a minute to match it up. Nice, Greddy. I hope you had a good time. How was it for you? Okay. Okay, is this matching? Am I getting somewhere? Should I put the sun up here? Okay, that piece definitely doesn't go there. Okay. What am I doing wrong? Trying to match the little picture the best I can. Okay, I think these two go together now. Um, Hot McFly, I, I'm confused on what you're saying. Please tell me. And, and I'm playing a totally different game today. I'm not playing Red Dead. We are playing Alone in the Dark. So let me know if, if um, I'm not hearing or reading something correctly. Okay. What the heck is going on? Okay, I feel like this picture kind of goes together right here. These two on the bottom. Okay. What the heck? I feel like these corner pieces I have to change, but it won't let me change those corner pieces. Okay, I feel like these ones look like they go together. What do you guys think? Maybe I'm tripping. Maybe I'm tripping. Okay. 
Okay, does that go together better now, this way? One thing, this is really a tricky puzzle. Wonder if I have any hints in my journals to help me with this puzzle. Yeah, Hot McFly, I'm playing Alone in the Dark. This game just came out a couple weeks ago. I am a detective. I'm Detective Crombry, and um, I am looking for this young lady's um, uncle, Jeremy. This game, I think, is based in the 1920s to the 1930s. Um, we came to this mansion to look for her uncle, but I don't know if the mansion's haunted, if I got cursed by looking at a creepy picture in the beginning of the game, but weird stuff's been happening. I go into a room and sometimes it warps into another room or it's just really crazy. So you do some puzzles and then a little action happens. There's some sort of freaks I'm killing right now, but yeah, so I'm just working on this little puzzle. It took me a while to, like, three streams before I got these plates, but you gotta play the game to get your clues unlocked, you know? Okay, is this like a sun? Is this supposed to be up here, this piece, or what? Or am I tripping? <laughs> I hope I didn't jack this up more than I needed to. I'm trying to follow the picture. It looks like there's this little church right here, but for some reason the sun looks like it should be up here on this side. Like, are these clouds? Should these clouds go up here more? Okay. Am I getting somewhere?
Dang. Dang it. Okay, I think I'm getting somewhere, guys. I think it's looking a little bit better. <laughs> what do you guys think? Okay, what am I missing, though? Does that look better now? Is that piece better? What the heck? Okay, I thought I thought that these would go right here, but this piece right here, I don't know if it goes right here. Man, this one is difficult. This one is really, really difficult. What to do, what to do. This piece doesn't go here. doing wrong okay those pieces definitely don't go I'm trying to paint a little picture where this will all fit Okay, is the sun looking like where it needs to be? Dang it. Okay, thanks for being patient, everybody. I'm sorry. I'm so focused on this. I don't know which way this puzzle goes. I'm trying my best, though, to match the pictures.
Okay, it looks like that bottom might be okay, <laughs> but it still kind of looks funky. I try to paint this picture. What do you guys think? <laughs> Shoot, man, I'm getting worried. I don't know how long I'm going to do this puzzle for. So it's it's almost like this is the little church right here little land here's the Sun look all these match up okay um, maybe this but that doesn't match right there isn't adding up here yo what up chuck welcome in happy monday thanks for the visit I'm trying to get this little puzzle done i'm working on this plate is it finished did i did i complete the puzzle it looks like it's okay to me no these two are like totally messed up right here. But I don't know where these two go. I thought this is where the sun goes because it matches all the other pieces okay. This looks okay. This looks okay. Okay, I thought I repaired it. What else do I need to do? It looks like that's how it goes to me. Well, wishing you luck on solving the puzzle. Thank you so much, Chuck. I appreciate that. Well, to me, if I'm not tripping, it looks like everything goes together. Like this. But this little piece right here looks like it may be out of place right here. But I don't know where else to put it. See, here's the valley, the church, the grass over here. Everything looks okay. I don't know where else to put this little piece.
Does it want to go there? Oh, did I do it now? Does this look better? Oh my gosh, this puzzle's hard. Now that I put this piece over here, now it kind of looks like better. It looks, if you guys see the picture, let me know if you could kind of get the picture. It looks like a sun on a little church and some farms, some land nearby. What else am I missing? Okay, I'm definitely tripping. These pieces do not go together. Okay, what piece am I missing now, yo? It looks like this is the best picture I've gotten so far. All these pieces look like they go together for me now, but what's what am I doing wrong now? It looks like a perfect picture. Let me know if you guys think so, too. picture looks lovely to me. What else could be missing? Ready, I try my best not to misbehave. <laughs> to me, you had all the other pieces right. That second one on the top, that doesn't look right. I thought the same thing, too. What? Forsaken crucifix. Okay. Nice. I missed something earlier. Okay. I just had to take a little break from that. <laughs> <laughs> it was a little exhausting. I tried really hard to follow the, the puzzle. And I don't know if I have anything that may help me um, make that. Yeah. Ow! What the heck? I thought I turned the power off. That was painful. Okay, shall I go back to it, Chuck? Let me see. Let me go back over there, Chuck. You know, it's always nice to have an extra pair of eyes on these puzzles. <laughs> Sometimes I just get impatient and be like, oh man, I gotta look at something else for a moment. Which one do you think doesn't look right, Chuck? I know, I feel like I'm off somewhere. Which one could it be, though? So these little tiny ones, I can't move them for some reason. The very tiny ones on each little four corner that looks like a little tiny slice of pizza, those ones I am not allowed to move. It will not let me. So 
Do you think these two may be out of the picture? But see, these ones line up really good together. Oh man, it's this top piece, huh? That doesn't probably belong there. I did it! Thanks, Chuck! <laughs> Thanks for your help. <laughs> Thank you so much. Yeah, I appreciate it. Thanks for having faith in me, guys. I wanted to give up and go look for something else. <laughs> What's wrong? Oh, is everything okay now? Oh, snap. Great, where do I find this puzzle at? Paul, you're right about the plates on the boiler and the clock. They have been sabotaged and I think I know who did it. They have something to do with Jeremy's episodes and how he seems to disappear at night. Right now it's important that you keep an eye out for any of the pieces. I want to find out if I can repair the plates. Let me know if you find any of them. Lottie. Oh, Lottie, we got it, my girl. Okay. I'm not sure what the combination is for this one. I love Resident Evil games, so I love puzzles, lol. By the way, I never played this game. <laughs> yeah, me neither. This is my first time, and I don't want to... If I get stuck, I'll just take a while to do it, but I don't want to look at anybody else complete something because it just makes it a lot more fun but i've played tomb raider games before back in the day um i know god of war the older ones like the first three they have like a lot of big boss fights and then a puzzle for you to like get out of a room or something so i don't mind games like that they're very interesting and fun I just wanted to play something different. I love Red Dead Redemption. It's an awesome game. It really helped grow my channel. I'll always have love for Red Dead, but I did get a PS5 in the beginning of the new year. So since I got a PS5, I've been wanting to play more games on my channel. So Monday through Wednesdays are gonna be my days where um, I play different games. I'll be working on those games. Like last week, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, I was playing this. Um, so I'll finish this out, and then the rest of the week I may stream a di um, Red Dead or just take some days off too, so try to switch it up, you know what I mean? I love Red Dead, but I also love gaming, and no gamer wants to get burnt out and not enjoy what they're playing, you know? Plus, I have so many games I've been wanting to play on the PS5. But thanks for that, Chuck. Yeah, I'll definitely be playing some of the newer Resident Evil games too. Oh my goodness. I know I will be playing Silent Hill when it releases. I pre-ordered the game <laughs> and I already paid for it, but I don't know when it's going to come out. <laughs> so I guess whenever GameStop calls me. <laughs> oh man, okay. I don't know where to find this information for this, um, this next little puzzle for the talisman. Okay. Where's Jeremy's diary? Do I still have Jeremy's diary? Let's see. What the heck? Because I know a few of my stuff are archived, but I'm looking for Jeremy's diary. See if it could give me anything. 111.10. Shall I? Nope, I can't even make it in that far. 111.10. If 
That's awesome. You seem really dedicated, LOL. I only game when I have time, but I'll definitely hit the follow. Hey, I appreciate that. Thank you so much, Chuck. I hope you're doing well today, Chuck. And thanks again for the visit. It was nice to get a little company during that puzzle. Even though this game could get a little scary, I could walk into a room with freaks, but at least I got some company. Okay, I need to find out this little puzzle. Let me see if I could look in any of my documents. I got the valve. This is Jeremy's diary. Is there a number in here? View. 358. I already did that one. Is there any other information in this diary? So I did this Tusselman plate, but that one was, I think, 358 maybe for the other, for the, um, the astronomical clock. I need to see what this one is. Okay, there's that painting. There's the painting I made. Oh man, I could have looked in here earlier. Look, guys, <laughs> that was in this um, Uncle Jeremy's um, diary. Uncle Jeremy is who I'm looking for. I'm a detective in the 1920s to the 1930s. Um, I don't know if a painting cursed me or if the mansion's cursed, but sometimes I'll go into a room and just some scary stuff will happen. Oh, there's a picture of that, but what is the clock? Okay. Oh, and it has another um, Zodiac combination in here. Wow. I'd be struggling and not even looking in all my um, <laughs> my documents when I'm all struggling with the, the combination to something. But that makes the game fun. You know, everybody plays it differently. All right, let's just read this now. I'm going to drink some water while we read this. Every night the dark man stands opaque at the threshold of my room, counting the days until my spirit spills out of my tired shape. Only his pallid mask shelters my remaining sanity, staring directly into the face of that demonic sultan would surely sunder time itself. Would he have looked the same to my father as he? Struggle for his life. Does his veiled face haunt my niece quite the same way? I wish so that I could rest my soul in that sunburnt convent of Tarawea. Would I find you there, Juan? Or Signora Pirosi? Back from the beyond? Every night I hide from him, moving from one misshapen memory to another. It seems conjured out of fantasy and delirium places I struggle to even paint. I wish I understood your death, Signora. Is there anything I could do for you but bury you in that bleak necropolis? That triumphant chapel rising above the ledges and the oven vaults shall be your sepulcher where you may rest, and I shall weep. Okay, sorry, I'm filling up my water. Make sure you guys stay hydrated. After my coffee, I gotta slam lots of water. How did you first come to understand such things, Senora? How did you know that the battered boil in the basement would lead me to Lafayette Cemetery? Or how the old upstairs clock with its astronomical motifs would take me to that hateful mound outside of Claremont Harbor? Those are my memories. My past. Is there perhaps a chance, if ever so small, for me to see Tarawea? Oh, I want that more than anything. Please, let my talisman take me there. Let me sit with Juan under his Bodhi tree. Despite having sold me that talisman, Miss Jackson, the voodoo priestess, revealed none of her secrets to me. That's why I had to travel to Tonka. 
Instead, she cruelly told Baptiste, my caretaker, that he would be betrayed and killed in the most awful way, that the one he loved would pierce his thigh with a sharp spear, and that he would be devoured by his own mother. What a terrible thing to say. The people of Desetto are becoming dangerous. They do not understand what they are doing. I must do something to stop them. I tried talking to Dr. Gray, but he confuses my worries. He's caught up in treating me. How can he expect evil to be cured with medicine and conversation? The orderlies, the housekeeper, and the patients are all deranged. They will call upon evil to enter this world. Oh, we'd be lost. Everything. Unless I can find the clerk, Mr. Waite. He seems to be a clear-thinking man. Maybe Beauregard. Okay, yeah, coffee sounds good, says Chuck. <laughs> yeah, how do you like your coffee? I like mine with cream and two sugars. <clears throat> Betty said, good, Sammy. Better behave or no pie for you. No, don't cut me off the pie. Now, if I have some pie, you could serve it with some black coffee. Since the pie is sweet enough. <laughs> okay, ladies and gentlemen. Again, you know, this game, you just got to take your time. Do the puzzles. Make sure you're not missing anything. I need to get this talisman, this combination, but I don't know where to find this combination. Last time I found the combination right above my head on the clock, but this time I don't think there is no clue above my head. Hidden on the boiler. Okay, the numbers are hidden on the boiler. Okay. But where at? Where's the numbers? Okay, thanks, Sammy. Where's the numbers? Where's the numbers? Okay. Let me look around really good. See if there's any numbers anywhere. I do not know where to find these ones. Objective: Find the tall the numbers hidden on the broil on the boiler. Where? Where's the numbers hidden? Oh, <laughs> I am an idiot. Is this the numbers? Seven five nine. Okay, <laughs> I am an idiot. Let's try it. Seven five nine. Let's let's see. Dang it. Sammy be messing up. Come on, be the numbers. Was it 759? No, it was not. 957, shall we try that? Oh, it was not those numbers. Seven, five, and nine. What the heck? Okay. Nope, not those ones. Bloody sound how? Okay, where what numbers then? Um, do I need to go back over here towards the wine cellar? Let me see if I can find some numbers over here. 
<clears throat> Chuck from the chat said, dark roast coffee for me because it takes away most of the acidic and prefer black with nothing on it. But I put coffee cream in it to be grass fed. I'm kind of picky on that, lol. <laughs> hey, you gotta be picky with your coffee, right? I don't blame you, Chuck. My preference on coffee is Turkish. Oh my goodness, I would love to have some Turkish coffee where they make it in the sun with the sand. I'd love to try that someday. Okay, is there any number over here? I don't see a number, guys. This one's a little tricky yeah. for me. Owie! <laughs> that was painful. <clears throat> Greddy says, no coffee for mischievous outlaws called Sammy. No! Don't cut me off my coffee. That's all I have. <laughs> I love me some coffee. I could drink a whole pot by myself, but I really only try to have two cups and then slam a bunch of water after that, you know? I know I shouldn't be up here. I just got a little impatient with that puzzle, but I don't know where the heck the numbers are. Find the tossum unhidden on the boiler. Oh my gosh. Let me go back down there. where the number would be at. Is it five seven nine maybe? No, it would have unlocked for me right away. trip in or do I see a seven five nine nine five seven I don't know where of uh, what other numbers I would have to be looking at hmm I am a little stuck I don't know where the next combination is for this one That is not the right code. Oh my gosh, Gred <laughs> Greddy, I promise I did not commit any of those crimes. I don't know what you're speaking of, young man. I do not. 
I promise I try to behave and respect Saint Denis when I mess around there. Plates on the broiler and the clock. Boiler and the clock, okay. Should I go back upstairs to the clock? Do you think that maybe it's a combination up there? I'm gonna walk back up to the clock. See what we got going on. It's such a long way. We're almost there, though. We're almost there. Thank you for your patience, everybody. I appreciate all of you beautiful people visiting my channel and hanging out with me. Gretty, I'm sorry I was focused on that puzzle earlier, brother. I will definitely go in there and be one of your moderators for your channel, and it would be an absolute honor. Okay, there is nothing for me to look at up here. There is no combo. How come I can't get the right combo then for the boiler room? What the heck am I doing wrong? What the heck's wrong with me? Much love to you too, brother. Thank you. Should I try 257? What the heck, man? That is a hard one. Man, that is fancy toilet. Old fashioned, but fancy. Okay. <laughs> Don't worry, you got this, says Chuck. Thank you, I appreciate it. <laughs> I got, I get impatient. I haven't played a puzzle game in a minute, and maybe I think I get more impatient because I'm streaming. But I'll, I've started over already one time when I did not need to. I didn't miss any pieces. <laughs> Let's go back downstairs. Man, this mansion is big. I really get lost. Angie, welcome back. Seven five nine. Dang it, not that combo. Okay, let's see. Sasquatch man, welcome in. How are you doing? Thanks for the visit. They said, look at the combination here. Am I wrong? Am I tripping? Can I not read? Find the tasselman numbers hidden on the boiler. Well, look, this looks like the only numbers I can see. <laughs> oh, look at that dark stuff back there. Oh, man. I don't see any, like, numbers scratched in or carved right here. I don't see any numbers here.
Angie, welcome back in. Okay, let's see. I don't know, guys. I don't know what to do right here. I'm trying to try different combos. You just have to make the numbers, I believe, says Chuck. Five seven. I tried seven five nine. Is it the temp degrees? I was hoping it was. It looked like it it didn't let that go in. Let's see. I tried 759. And then I'm trying different combinations of them. I, I was hoping it was that one, Sasquatch Man. I really was. <laughs> yeah, see. What a trip. Okay, because the objectives say, find the Tosselman numbers hidden on the boiler. Okay, these are the only numbers that I see, though. Let me look around and see if there's anything else, maybe, that I missed. Did somebody carve it in to the boiler? No, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Hmm... Seven five nine. Shall I try that one? Thank you guys for your help and your patience. I appreciate it. Seven five nine. No, what the heck? I'm trying every combination of these numbers that I possibly can. the heck <gasps> whoa I got it finally what the heck I can't even remember oh, what number another room must be a way to another one of Jeremy's memories What the heck was that? Dang, that was a was a toughie. So it was a combination of those. I really had to mix it up. I think it was seven five nine guys. <laughs> Sasquatch man says, Hell yeah. Nice. So I got that broiler fixed, okay. The boiler is fixed. Okay, let's come over here. What is the next objective? Oh no. Okay, let's go find Emily, yeah? Muffin Nog 18, what's up and welcome in. Thanks for the visit. Whoa, did did this did this um this kitchen door looked different the last time I came in through here. I think the house switched. I'm scared to go into a room. Let's see. 
Let's see what's going to happen, ladies. What? I can't even get out of any of these rooms? What the bloody Sam hell is this? How scary. Oh my gosh. Where did we go, guys? <laughs> Where did we go? Oh my gosh. I'm scared. Damn. I knew it. I knew it would work. I'm getting good at this, Carnby. I know I'm too good at this. What the family, yo? Where did we go? I wonder if I need to make sure there's nothing in here before we bounce out, okay? Because I have to collect these sets, so let me make sure I'm not missing anything. Oh, that was the wine cellar room, okay. All right, nothing to get, guys. Let's go. <laughs> <clears throat> that was a tricky little puzzle. Thanks, though, for your help, Chuck. It was a different combination of those numbers. I had to keep trying it. Sometimes I walk to another room thinking that's going to help me with the puzzle, but I better just stay my ass there <laughs> and finish the puzzle. Okay. This looks like a freaking messed up Call of Duty Zombies map. All right. Where am I? I'm in some sort of bayou. Let me make sure I'm not forgetting anything now. Wow, was it really? Yay, another win for you. <laughs> Thanks, Chuck. Yeah, it was one of those numbers. I had to switch up the combination. But I feel like I kept doing the, the same combinations a couple times. I'm so scared. Now what do we got here? Another flipping puzzle. There's something missing. What's missing? All right. Oh, dang. There's like a lot of places to go over here. Uh-oh, looks like there's going to be some sort of freak over here. I'm going to go check this room. If you, if you have throwing bricks in this game, there's going to be a freak you could throw the bricks the Hartwood's at. family crypt. Emily's family must have deeper roots in New Orleans than I thought. I figured she was a Yankee like me. What's a Yankee? Someone that's not from here? Oh, what the heck? Ladies and gentlemen, give me one moment. I'll be right back. I need to use the washroom. Give me one second and I'll be right back. Thank you. Hey, Kill em All with Karma, what's up and welcome in. Thank you so much for the visit and I appreciate the kind words. Alrighty. Oh, it looks like it's getting more daytime out here or am I tripping? Looks like we're going to have to kill a freak over here and I'm not prepared for this.
All right, let's get it. Let's get it. Oh, damn it. <laughs> I didn't want to waste my ammo, but I think there's a freak coming up. Oh, I guess not. Guess I'd be bucking off shotgun shells for nothing. Oh snap, oh snap. Where's these free- ah! Oh my gosh. Oh. Man, one hit and these guys will kill you. Oh, that was scary. Reload your gun. How do I reload? <laughs> I just want to reload. All right, let's see what's going on up here. The blessing key item, okay. What's this? Okay. All right. Got it. Nice. What should I take, the pickaxe or the sledgehammer? Oh, that is such a hard choice to make. Oh, I'm scared. Okay, okay, what is this freak? Oh my god, swing, bad as swing. Oh my god. Oh my gosh! Ah! Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! Ah! Oh my gosh! Jesus! Well, I got a trophy for that. Hard boiled. Oh my gosh, that was so scary. Definitely take the sledgehammer now. I'm telling you, ladies and gentlemen, it's one shot. One shot, and these freaks will kill you. Please forgive my screaming, everybody. Those things just really scare me. I don't know what that is. Some sort of swamp monster? Some... I don't know. I have no idea. Somehow I ended up in a cemetery and I don't know, but... But we are here. It was the chapel Jeremy had mentioned in his book. With a bit of luck, soon Combi would be able to catch up with the old man. He just needed to find a way inside the chapel. Jeremy sketched this chapel in his book, so it must be important. Looks like I'll need more medallions to open it, though. I don't think I have everything I need. We never have everything we need in this game, but let me look around, see if we can find any sets. What's up and welcome in, everybody. Thanks so much for the visit. I'm a little scared, but we'll get through this. We'll get through this. Can I go this way? No! Oh wait, I thought I had some keys. Do I have some keys? <sighs> oh great. Oh my goodness, it's a freak. Oh shoot, there's a big one over there. Oh my gosh, he looks so scary. I 
to that freak over there, guys. Oh, shoot. I'm a goner. I'm a goner. <laughs> oh my goodness, drink your liquor, Sam. <laughs> Who in the hell is still getting me? Is there something in the water? <sighs> That's so damn scary. Oh, what is that? That was scary, not gonna lie. <laughs> Caught me off guard. Is there any more ammo or life over here? Gretty says, if I get rid of the monsters, will you behave in Saint Denis? Yes, yes I will, Gretty. Thank you. And thank you for making me a managing mod. That is awesome. Okay. I didn't even wear boots, so I'm not even dressed for the occasion. Give me back my sledgehammer. Give me the sledgehammer. I need it. Get up off me. Get up off me. Man, these guys are so scary. It's not even... It's not even nothing to joke about. They will mess your life up. Look at this freak! Oh my goodness! How am I gonna drink alcohol and then he could just hit me again? That is cold blooded. Dang, that is cold blooded. Take a shot of revival. Dang, these guys are vicious. What the hell is this? Alright, we're going in. We're going in. What's gonna happen when we go in? It's blocked. Oh, damn. All right. Guess you're gonna go in and not come back, Sam. Okay, I'm gonna make sure nothing else is here. Okay, let's go, let's go. I feel like I'm missing trinkets or something to get, but I don't think there is nothing to get. Oh, snap. There's shovels and bottles to beat people. Those freaks are coming, okay. I don't know where to go. I'm so scared. There's like a bunch of different places to go. Okay, that room we can't go. Okay, this is trippy. Why would it have me open that, but there's nothing for me? Okay, nice. We got another plate. Okay, a rustic plate. Okay, nice. 
Oh my goodness. I'll beat him through the I'll beat him through the gate. Oh snap, I broke my I broke it. <gasps> come at me, come at me, fool, come at me. Let's go. Let's dance, baby. Let's dance. Goodness, that is so scary. Oh, shoot. Damn it, guys. I think I messed up. Break yourself, fool. Break yourself. Oh my gosh, I think- Ah, get that as a fire! I think I just killed myself. Ah. I didn't go into that other room though, so I, I, I kind of wanted to go backwards and go up into that other room. Okay, nice. Got some pistol bolts. Where did, where did it save me at? Oh, okay, this is where I first started. Dang, that was scary, yo. That was so scary. A crucifix! Yay, I think I just got me a little set unlocked. Did I? Why do I have this crucifix in my hand? Am I going to beat somebody with it? Do I need the crucifix for something? <laughs> oh my goodness. Guess I can't have any other weapon. Oh, I could beat him with it. Dang, okay. Powerful weapon. Okay, that was a good little beating. I don't know if you've seen that beating. That was a little good one. I feel like I should go the other way I did though. I feel like it's gonna trap me. Let me go back. Kill them all with karma. Hope you're having a good day. Oh no, it's all good. You got this. <laughs> Thanks, karma. Uh, you know, it's not really like an action -y game. It doesn't give you like quick reactions like a combat game or a first person shooter. So like it's like one hit and you're already almost dead. Then you drink an alcohol bottle and that makes you almost dead. Oh, okay. Oh my goodness, go, 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 beat him, beat him, beat him. Get up off me. I broke my teeth at this time. Oh my gosh! Did they both die? Oh, that was so scary. Man, that was scary, not gonna lie. No, I have not played Outlast. Kind of reminds me of it a bit. No, I have not. Wait, wait, wait. Where are you going, girl? No, I don't want to go this way. Great, I left my freaking weapon. Okay, let's go back. Okay, get your weapon before these freaks try to beat me. <laughs> Why do I keep going through the wall? What's up? Welcome in, guys. Welcome in. 
Appreciate it. Billy Dole, welcome in. He says, I am your Huckleberry. Well, thank you. How you doing, Mr. Dole? I feel like I'm missing something. Did I, like, get all the plates and the things I needed? have to make sure guys because I know we can't come back to certain parts in the game so before we bounce to the next one I gotta make sure I have everything okay let me see what these freaks have entitled for me nice more ammo I need some ammo for the shoddy though my shotgun Is this where I came through? Oh, this is where I came through. Okay, never mind. All right, let's go. <laughs> oh, I'm scared. Wait, did I go through every room? <gasps> Wait, I did not before I went through that other section. I didn't know we could come down here. What? It looks hella scary, not gonna oh. even lie. What's down here? Oh my gosh. Oh, another freaking plate and another puzzle. Okay, great. Lovely. Oh, what? These could go there? Am I tripping? I don't think I have any little clues to tell me how this one goes. But we'll try our best. Yo, what up? Chaotic Fox, welcome in. How are you doing? Thanks for the visit. That can't be right. Hmm. Not the right plate. Do I need to go upstairs and get more stuff? I know I need a few plates though. Oh, three medallions. Do I even have three? Okay, I have two, so I need to find one more. Maybe I better go between this wall. Great, there's a big ass freak. Oh my goodness! Oh my gosh, she killed me so quickly! I had a save right there. Yo, Chuck, thank you so much for the visit and thank you so much for the sub. I appreciate it. He says, I gotta go, but I'll be with you in spirit. <laughs> 
Thank you. I appreciate it. You have a good one, and thanks so much for the visit. Oh, snap! Homeboy was... Oh, he was tough. Got another crucifix to beat him with, I'll tell you that. Is that the last plate? Nope. Take it easy, Chuck. We'll see you in the next one. Okay. Those things sound so scary. I feel like I'm missing something. Gotta run. Have a great stream. Quick stop. Thank you. I really appreciate that, Fox. I hope you're having a good day. Okay, where the heck is the last plate now? We need to find Jeremy and we need to find the last place. Um, the lap pl last plate. Excuse me. I get scared in here when I go into this crazy world. I don't know what kind of freaks I'm going to encounter. I hope I wasn't missing a plate from outside. Okay. Let's try this little pattern. Okay, why won't it let me move them? Okay, there we go. I didn't know I could switch the plates, guys, so... Be taking forever on the puzzles. I appreciate your patience. If you guys want to help me out too, feel more than free to. Sometimes if I get a little like brain clustered with um, a puzzle, I'll kind of walk around and do something else and then come back. Whoa, what the heck is that? Okay. What did I just walk into? Jeremy, your ass better be down here. This is so creepy, yo. That is hella creepy. <laughs> Karma. Yeah, this is something else. to thinking this was a puzzle game to being petrified. Dang. The heck was up with that? Oh, 
Oh, your map is no use here. Oh, ow. Oh, damn! How am I gonna make it out of here, yo? That is how a people to beat up. Oh my gosh, what am I gonna do, guys? <laughs> that is scary. I could sneak if I press triangle. I'm just gonna have to go really, really quiet and mellow and not scream. Oh my gosh. Oh my god. Oh my god. Run, run, run. Just run. Get the heck out of my way, I'm running. Ah! Ah! Go, Sammy, go. Oh my god. What the heck was that? Oh my goodness. My nice shoes are all messed up. Karma said, and you can see where they they line up. Go, 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 go. <laughs> that was scary. Heck yeah. <laughs> I'm sure you guys could take a closer look at those freaks, but they look so scary. Okay. Oh my gosh, I hope I didn't get stuck. Sometimes I walk on something in this game and I get stuck and I'll have to like reload where I last had a save point. That's one thing that's a little crazy. Oh my god, another plate! Yes! Nice! No Alright, I got three medallions, but I don't even know where I ended up at. <laughs> Let me make sure I search the place good. I feel like I just ran through those tunnels. I'm scared. I hope I didn't miss anything, but I would die with all those freaks. Please forgive me for calling them freaks, but I don't know what they are. I thought they were a, like a zombie, a swamp monster. They're just really crazy looking. All right, hopefully we're getting a little closer to Jeremy now. That was a lot of scary, says Karma. <laughs> Yes, it was. It was the chapel Jeremy had mentioned in his book. The medicine bottles had stains of rot. The medicine bottles... It was the chapel Jeremy had mentioned in his book. With a bit of luck, soon Combi would be able to catch up with the old man. He just needed to find a way inside the chapel. <sighs> Thank God that's over. Welcome in. Thanks for watching, everybody. I know, those monsters are scary. They look like some sort of freaks, like some mutants. <laughs> oh god, those birds scared me. Did I already search all of this stuff over here? Yeah, I think I already came through here in the beginning. Just want to make sure I'm not missing anything. This doesn't look good. Oh snap, who is that? Oh my goodness. Whose body is that? Who in the bloody Sam hell is that? Oh no, she was in a wheelchair. Oh no. Does not look good. That does not look very good. Let me make sure there's no collectibles for me to gather. 
I wish I can help that lady. Okay, am I back to the beginning? Or the middle part at least? All right. Oh my goodness, I don't have any clues for how these go. Oh, can I not switch this third one? Okay, let's see. How the heck do these go now? I don't have any clues on how these plates go. That can't be right. Well, hold on. Let me look at some of my stuff. Where's Jeremy's diary? Okay, is this how the plates go in there now? Do I see the plates? Is that the same plates I have in this journal? Hopefully it might leave me a little clue. Let's see what's up. Mm. Is that how they go? Let's see. That can't be right. Well, hold on. Let me look at the. It takes so long to get back to the um, the journal. Okay, the hand going up, the bird on the right hand side, and on the left hand side is the sheep or whatever that may be. Okay, let's see. Okay, guys, I hope this is right. Okay, yes. Yes! Let's get it. Let's get it. Let's get it. So you gotta always look at those journals. Please don't touch her. Jeremy. What are you doing here? Everyone's looking for you. I know. It, it's all a big mess. No one understands. I, I'm just trying to keep evil at bay. Just for a little while longer. You've got to come back with me. Your niece is waiting at Dorsetto. Emily? Why would you... My letter. I keep making it worse. What is going on, Jeremy? How is any of this happening? I made, I made a terrible promise with someone. The Dark Man. Who is he? No, 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 don't say his name. He can hear us. He's always listening. Jeremy, I need to understand what is going on. I promised him everything. The sun rises, I will be chained in his sunken desert temple for an eternity. But at least the evil about to awaken and Dissetto won't harm anyone outside of that cursed place. You're acting crazy, Jeremy. I want to help. There's nothing you can do. Then what's all the business about Terawea? Why did you want to go there? I can't go there. Not allowed. But you wanted to. Can I go? Tell me, will it help me to break your pact? Is there something there that would help? Why would you give me hope? That's so cruel. Okay. Sounds like we're onto something here. What should I- Look out! Behind you! Run! Don't let him take you! Ugh! 
What the actual family just happened, guys? So we finally found Jeremy. We finally found Uncle Jeremy. We got unks now. And then that happened. That creature looked really scary. Yo, what up, Wasting Tech? Welcome in, brother. Howdy and happy Monday. Thanks so much for the visit. Hope you had a good weekend. I've seen so many strange occurrences lately. Memories explode into existence and then burn out like tied glass bulb filaments. Dreamscapes crash down from the stars and sink into the sea. Doors that lead to nowhere and absolutely everywhere at once. With all this reverie, I want to think there's a chance that you found a way to remain alive in some way I cannot fathom. Just like I've learned to navigate with my talisman, maybe you, with all your knowledge, you somehow knew a way. A way to find me again, perhaps in Terroya. Oh, my love, Jeremy. All my love, Jeremy. Luggage key, nice. Found and lost. I just got a trophy. Let me know if you guys can see when I get a trophy. I feel like I rewatched the stream and I can't see. Unlock Jeremy's secret trunk. Oh my goodness, that's about time we're gonna unlock the trunk. She's dead. No matter how she died, she looks peaceful now. Oh my goodness. Are those the same high hills that are over there on her? <laughs> oh man, that was awesome, guys. That was a good stream today. I had fun. We found out some good stuff. We found Uncle Jeremy. He's stuck in the crazy, crazy voodoo world, crazy voodoo swamp. I don't know where Uncle Jeremy is at, but we've seen a crazy beast. Wasting Texas, no trophy. Oh, I just got one now. I got a, um, a silver one, so that was awesome. But as much as I do not want to leave, guys, I think that I'm going to bring the game to an end right here. Uh, we'll pick up the stream tomorrow morning. I'll definitely be on the same time tomorrow, and we'll, we'll take care of this. We'll get on this game. But I think that's a good stopping point for today. Thank you guys so much for being here. Wasting Tech, Karma, everybody, thank you guys for the visit. Sasquatch Man, um, Chaotic Fox, Billy Dole, Greddy, Chuck, um... Everybody who came in today, thank you guys so much. Ghost, Brave Kratos, Hot McFly, Sapphire, Gen X Gaming, Jose, Julio. We have a lot of people that came in. Thank you guys so much. Monet, thank you for coming through. And Shally, I appreciate everybody. And Zaphyrus, thank you for being here today. Um, I will see you guys tomorrow in the next stream. <clears throat> Excuse me. We'll definitely see what's going on now. What the heck crazy um, Uncle Jeremy is up to. But you guys take it easy and stay gold. Thanks so much again for the visit. Big hugs from your girl Sam. And have a good evening, okay? We'll see you in the next stream. Okay. Bye now. Bye-bye. <laughs>